our mission is to help you learn the English language. We have created easy to follow free educational materials for those seeking knowledge of English. Good morning. Can I help you? Yes. Do you have any seats available on a flight for Beijing leaving at 15? Sure we do. First class or economy? One economy, please. Do you have anything to declare? No, I have nothing. Are these all your personal things? Yes, they are. Please open the black case. Okay. Excuse me, miss. The total works wrong. What are these extra charges? There's a 20% service charge in this hotel. Well, what's this $138 charge then? That's for the hotel restaurant. You had five meals here. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Sorry. I'll pay cash. I need to cancel my reservation. I have personal matters that need fixing. That's not a problem. Just give me your name, phone number, and date of visit. Rudy Randolph, 818-555-1234, April 9th through 15. I see your info here on the screen. I'll hit just one button, sir, and you're cancelled. Thank you. I'm glad that wasn't too much of a bother. It's a pleasure. Hello. Excuse me. Do you know if there's a commercial bank around here? Yes. Go straight along Beijing Road and turn right. Straight on and turn right. Is it far? No. It's just a couple of minutes. Thanks very much. You're welcome. Hello, miss. Can I see your ticket number? Sure. Here you are. And here are my application forms as well. Thank you, Miss Wong. I'm Bob Jones and I'll be handling your application. Nice to meet you, Mr. Jones. The first step is to determine your eligibility for a U.S. visa. Let's see here you're applying for a special business visa. Why is that? Well, my first order of business will be attending a conference in Seattle. But after that I intend to spend two weeks visiting my friends. I assumed a business visa would be required. I think a regular visitor's visa should suffice. With this visa, you can stay in the United States for up to 90 days. So I can attend conferences and do business on that visa? Yes. You are free to do temporary business with this visa. If you are planning on setting up a new business in the U.S., you might need to apply for a long-term visa. Oh, I see. I think 90 days is more than enough time. We will go to Luoyang for a vacation next month. How long will you stay there? About one week. Where will you live during the vacation? In the hotel. Have you made a reservation? Yes, we have. That's okay. I'd like to have the film developed. For color prints? Yes. When can I get it back? I can't wait to see the photos. About three days. Fine. I'd like two enlargements from this negative. Here's your receipt. I'm taking my date to a restaurant. 
Could you tell me about one or two good ones? My pleasure. How much would you like to spend on your date? She will want an excellent restaurant, of course. You should know that our hotel chef was trained in Paris. The service and food are world class. I wanted to go out somewhere, not stay here. Do you know of another good restaurant? You can't go wrong with Gramercy Tavern. It's famous for its food, service, and live jazz. I like that. Could you please call them to see if we can get in tonight? At once, sir. You'll love this place, I assure you. Excuse me. I have booked one ticket on BN 118 for tomorrow. But now I've changed my plan. Can you help me refund the ticket? Sure. Here is the ticket. Okay, madam. I have refunded it. You have to pay $15 for it. Could you bring me some food, please? Sure. What do you fancy? Can I have a bottle of champagne, lobster tail, and filet mignon, medium rare? Sir, the filet mignon was so popular tonight that we ran out. May I suggest the porterhouse? Oh, no filet? Okay. Porterhouse will be fine then. Perhaps you would like chocolate-covered strawberries with the champagne? Not tonight. But thank you for the suggestion. Okay. This will be charged to your amenities account, okay? No problem. Your food will be brought to you momentarily. I hope you enjoy it. What can I do for you? I'd like to be waken up tomorrow morning. Okay, sir. At what time? Well, how long is it from here to the train station? If you take a taxi, it will be 20 minutes. Then please wake me up at 7. Ew. Thank you. I'd like to have a couple of complete sets of paper money and coins. Yeah. You can take them home and either use them as a gift or keep them as mementos. Ah. Oh, where can I find old paper money and coins used before and after 1949? I'd suggest that you go to the Philately store in Nanjing Road East, where the items are authentic and the prices are reasonable. Good. Sorry to have troubled you so much, miss. You're always welcome. Anything else can I do for you, sir? No, thanks. I did not notice it has been dark outside. I think it is time to dinner. I guess it is. The restaurant is on the second floor. Please enjoy your dinner, sir. I've been looking for a swimming pool, but I haven't found one yet. We have no pool. Sir, but we do have swim stations in our gym. Swim stations? Could you be a little more explicit? You know how you run on a treadmill but don't go anywhere? Well, it's the same thing. Gee, that's a great idea. Now, how much do I have to pay? The stations are absolutely free to guests, sir. Great. Now, when can I go down there and use the stations? The swim stations are open daily from 7 a.m. to 10 p.m. Boy, oh boy, I can't wait to change into my swim trunks. Be warned, sir. At certain hours the swim stations are very crowded. I'm sorry. Your visa has expired. What? You're kidding. Let me see that there must be some mistakes. 
I'm afraid you'll need to have your visa extended before we can have you check in. Oh, it's a pity. This is the route I thought we could take on our hike on Saturday afternoon. How long is it altogether? It's about six or seven miles. That's about ten kilometers. That sounds okay. So, we start here at the car park and walk along the path to the waterfall. Right. Then we turn left and walk up this small hill. The view from the top of the hill is worth the climb. We can eat a snack there. Then we will follow this path down the hill to the old church. We can spend a few minutes looking around the church. Then, we turn right and walk along this path. This path leads to the cave. Can we look inside the cave? Yes, we can, but it isn't very interesting. Then we turn south and come back to the car park along this path. That's right. How long do you think it will take us to complete the walk? I think it will take about four hours, including breaks. That's fine. Are there signposts along the way, in case we get lost? Yes, there are. They tell you which way to go and how far we have to walk. Let me see your passport, please. Oh, here you are. You come from Germany, don't you? Yes, and come here for tourism. How long will you be staying in China? Twenty days. Okay, have you filled in the declaration form? Yes, here is the form. Is this your luggage? Yes, only one travel bag. What do you have in the luggage? Nothing but several personal effects. That's all. Thank you for your cooperation. Thank you for calling World Airline. What can I do for you? I need to book a plane ticket to London. Round trip or one way? One way. What date would you like to fly? Saturday, July 25th. How many people will be traveling? Just one adult. Which class? Economy, please. Economy class is the cheapest, right? Right. Okay. The fare is $700. Hello, sir. How many in your party? Just myself. What is the rate? Okay. A single fare is $50 per right. Fine. Do I have to show my passport? No, it's not necessary. But you have to fill out this form. Sure. You guys are charging me $10 for a movie that I never ordered or saw. Let's see, sir. According to your file, you watched Titanic Monday evening. Well, the wrong information is in my file. I was at a concert Monday night. Well, your word overrules the file, sir. One moment, please. I knew you'd see it my way. Sir, I deleted the $10, but I had to add a $2 service charge to your bill. Am I in the twilight zone? You're charging me for a movie I never saw? Please don't blame me, sir. Blame the computer programmer. This is highway robbery. I've got a good mind to call the police. If it makes you feel any better, other guests feel the same way. Our mission is to help you learn the English language. We have created easy to follow free educational materials for those seeking knowledge of English.